What's up guys? As you guys know that Apple has released 18.4 beta 1, iOS 18.4 beta 1. And after using for one day, I'm gonna talk about five things about this uh, new iOS update. And uh, let's begin with the first one. Uh, if you go in the news, the first change I noticed uh, in the news, uh, wow, two faces in the front. Anyway, if you tap on following and then you see here the section food section is uh, entirely new it was, was not in older iOS version and here you have a recipe, recipe category and saved recipe so if you go in recipe category you can jump over to whatever you're looking for baked uh, soup dessert or vegetarian if you are 30 minutes recipe or for dinner so you can <clears throat> you have lots of choices if you are if you're not sure what to cook if you do cooking at home so you have tons of options here to go through and decide uh, what you can have and the second thing uh, is it's a change in the Siri now you can instead of talking to Siri now you can type <clears throat> you know so if you if you go into settings and then you go to uh, accessibility here and then you swipe up and go to Siri. So if you see your option here, so let me grab a pen, it's a little easier, I think, for you guys to see. So if you toggle this on, now you can actually uh, type that message to, instead of talking, you know, <clears throat> you can type the message, excuse me, and I'll show you. If you press the this button, so the keyboard pops up, type to Siri. So instead of talking, if if I type, I so I mean she will type back. So so that's a cool feature, you know. It's a it's a new thing. If you're using older iOS 18.3, you're not gonna see this option because I forgot to show you in the beginning. The only I mean if you this is developer beta actually. Uh, see 18.4 beta one. So as you can see. And if you have this uh, beta update, then you'll see this message in 18.3, this is not available. So another cool thing, if you swipe down from the right and uh, the control center, and if you press and hold here, add control. So here you are in, in a whole new world here. There are a few changes and uh, change i'm talking about is the music ambient music music here you can see it as sleep chill productivity or well-being so you have four options so rather than going to the music app you can play right from here i don't want to play actually otherwise uh, <clears throat> first you have to add this you know by tapping on it so for due to copyright issues i don't really want to play the music but you can explore all these options to add into control center you can see that there are lots of options here. So now, <clears throat> the next thing after this is, if you go to home screen, and if you press and hold here, and then you go to edit. Okay, so you go to edit at the top and customize. So in tint option, now you have, you have a, an option for dark mode as well. Before it was a, all like white background now you have light dark automatic tint so in tint you can even you know select dark or light whatever you like so this is also a new option in 18.4 beta 1 <clears throat> so another thing i noticed which was not in a previous beta as you can see here the the speaker but when i put the volume up is blue but when i put it all the way down it turns white so I want you to tell me if it's a glitch or they did it intentionally because this one is a older iOS and if I swipe down and if I put the volume all the way down, I don't think it turns white. You see here, it's blue, it's all the way down. And then when I put the volume up, it stays blue. But here in this case, it goes blue when the volume is on. I think it's a cool feature, but let me know in the comments if it's a glitch or Apple did it on purpose. And finally, I'll talk about a little bit about the release notes. You know, if you if you go in the 
Apple website and you know in this update what do you exactly get so you can go through these release notes and you can get lots of information there and because it's hard to talk about all this uh, single feature you know in the small video and you can go through this I'll, I'll leave the link in the description if you want to explore like what what's new in this uh, features and i'll see you in the next video thank you very much for watching